Do you work in food production or the so-called life science segment? Then I am convinced that hygiene is the key issue for you. That already begins with the storage of raw materials. It affects the production process naturally and hygiene is important in the packaging process as well. In life science industries, strict guidelines safeguard the entire manufacturing process from unwanted and perhaps even toxic contamination. The latest pandemic has once again shed a blinding light on the relevance of clean air, not just limited to life science, but for all ventilation systems in non-residential buildings. This webinar will focus on opportunities you have to minimize the risk of airborne contamination in food, in food production processes. Our emphasis, of course, is on taking a closer look at the filtration setup and your particular air treatment system. In case you would like to regularly be updated on topics from the world of air filtration, you can, completely free of charge, attend Delbach monthly webinars. There'll be an interesting, as much as different focus every single month. Just subscribe to our LinkedIn channel or follow our monthly white paper publication. You can, needless to mention, also ask your local Delbach consultant to conduct webinars for your business or institution. Your local Delva consultant would then host these webinars in your local language and would therefore reach out to you and to your team even more personally. What are the biggest pains in life science related operational processes? First of all, safety is the most prominent issue. That means while making sure food and pharmaceuticals do not come into contact with any kind of toxic substance, the operator also has to ensure that food and pharmaceutical products are by no means exposed to any kind of microbiological growth. Second of all, full and coherent documentation is essential. Specifically for air filtration, this certification is twofold. It has to guarantee the claimed technical performance of the air filter. And at the same time, it needs to serve as proof that the filter does not impose any kind of danger for the storage, for the manufacturing or packaging process. Consequently, operators would therefore be well advised to be prepared for external audits carried out by any local government authority. Thirdly, the use of food safe air filters makes life of any general manager a lot easier. He or she can rest assured that he has fully enforced all precautions possible to prevent unwanted airborne contamination. With regards to the safety, the choice of air filter elements should be an air filter element arrangement that contains no toxic components in the design of the air filter element. Depending on your particular air treatment system, the air filter design may vary. Consequently, the components used to make the filter may vary as well. Any plastics, metal, the filter garment, glue, or bonding fluid should be completely non-toxic, as well as fully food and pharmaceutically safe. A component on an air filter element that is frequently overlooked is the gasket. Standard gaskets on air filters regularly have open pores. And even more so, standard gaskets 
quite often contain softeners. When choosing an air filter, food production units should make sure that gaskets have been fully approved for the usage in food and pharmaceutical production processes. The documentation that will serve as proof are independent material certifications in accordance with the EC 1935-2004. The EC 1935-2004 is a European directive for materials used to manufacture and pack food. In accordance with this directive, these materials must not contain any softeners and they may not leak any kind of gas. The VDI 6022 is a general guideline for the, for the hygienic setup and maintenance of air filters in air treatment systems. It recommends the use of Eurovent certified filter products and it recommends specific air filtration setups depending on the predominant local outdoor air quality. And at the same time, the specific air filter application inside the building. Additionally, Delbach also grants full certification that filters labeled for food safe usage are also compliant with the ISO 846 1997. The ISO 846-1997 is an international standard for classifying the degree of microbiological growth in plastics and gaskets. In order to truly make your life easy, all Delbach food safe filters are and look different than Delbach standard product line. Each Delbach food safe filter is clearly labeled as such, and there is a specific food safe labeling making the filter easy to distinguish even before it being installed. The filter elements are shipped in small bundles to simplify unpacking and to avoid any unnecessary handling on site. Each food safe Delbach filter element is individually wrapped in a hygienic pouch, avoiding any foreign substance exposure, even during long times of transport. Allow me to introduce you to the various filter designs that Delbach offers as a Vital version. All Vital filter elements have a full usage certification for food and pharmaceutical production processes. The bag filter line G uses premium microglass of filter garments, and this line is available for filter classes EPM10, EPM2.5, and EPM1. For food safe applications, we recommend the use of food safe plastic filter frames. The alternative galvanized steel frame would react when exposed to acid typically found in fruit juices, for example. Should you want us to apply a gasket, we exclusively use non porous PU gaskets only on all the food safe bag filter in the Vital version. As this bag filter's performance is rated in accordance with the ISO 16890, this line is of filter is fully Eurovent certified and is also classified for its energy consumption. The bag filter line N uses the premium nanowave synthetic garment. This line is available for filter classes EPM1 65% and EPM1 80%. For food safe applications to be used, we also recommend the use of food safe plastic filter frames. As mentioned before, the alternative galvanized steel frame again would react when exposed to acids typically found in fruit juices, for instance. Should you specify the need for a gasket, 
We exclusively use non-porous PU gaskets on all the food safe backfilter Vital versions. As this backfilter's performance, just like the backfilter G line, is rated in accordance with the ISO 16890, N line backfilters are Eurovent certified and are also classified for their energy consumption. The panel filter Multiplan uses microglass paper and hot melt threads separation in between the pleats. This line is available for filter classes EPM10, EPM2.5, and EPM1. For food safe applications, we recommend the use of food safe plastic filter frames, wooden or steel frames, often found in various HVAC applications, are neither certified in accordance with the EC1935 nor the ISO 846. Should you want us to apply a gasket, we exclusively use non-porous PU gaskets only on all the food safe multi-plan Vital panel filters. As all multi-plan panel filters are rated in accordance with the 16890 ISO, the liner filter is Eurovent certified. This particular Panel filter design is frequently used when the space for a filter element in an air treatment system is very limited or air flows tend to be extremely turbulent. The compact filter line multiform uses pleated microglass paper and hot melt threads as separators in between the pleats. The multiform has four compartments, and each of the filter packs are arranged in Vs facing each other. This line is available for filter classes EPM 160% and EPM 180%. Should you want us to apply a gasket, we exclusively use non porous U gaskets only on all the food safe multiform premium Vital compact filters. As all the multiform compact filters are rated in accordance with the ISO 16890, this line of filter is also fully Eurovent certified. This particular compact filter design is frequently used for turbulent airflows as well as for stringent requirements on the energy consumption of the filter element. The Macropua H13 Vital filter is a HEPA filter in class H13. It uses pleated microglass paper and hot melt threads as separators in between the pleats. The Macropua H13 has four compartments and each of the filter packs are arranged in these facing each other. This particular filter is available in filter class H13 only. It is fully incinerable due to its food safe plastic housing. The Makopur H13 Vital HEPA filter is equipped for a nominal airflow volume of 3,500 cubic meters of air per hour, and it filters 99.995% of particles at 0 0.2 microns of aerodynamic diameter. The absolute poor Vital filter line includes panel HEPA filters ranging in their class from E11 to U15. All absolute poor filters use pleated microglass paper and hot melt threads as separators in between the pleats. The absolute poor Vital HEPA filters ca are cast into aluminum or stainless steel filter housings. Food safe grip protection and gaskets are available on the crude air side as well as on the clean air side of the filter element. Please note, HEPA filters are not in the scope of the Eurovent certification scheme. However, as each Delbach HEPA filter is individually tested in accordance with the ISO 18022, 
their technical performance is documented, guaranteed, and tracked. Why is Eurovent certification essential for developing trust in the air filtration market? What is the customer proposition or added value of a Eurovent certified filter? During the recurrent annual recertification process, the Delbach manufacturing sites were audited and checked for ISO 9001 and ISO 14001 standards. Our SKUs are randomly picked straight from the stock shelf or even right from the production line by a Eurovent auditor every single year. The product samples that are then selected by the auditor during his or her on-site factory visit are then thoroughly tested by independent laboratories strictly according to the latest industrial standards. There are currently only three accredited independent Eurovent test labs, CITIAT in France, RISE in Sweden, and VTT in Finland. Delbach's entire PM1 to EPM10 filter range needs to be publicly reported for every single product variant. We need to make sure that test readings are made available to the European team for every single full-size filter in our portfolio. Energy efficiencies were also evaluated in accordance with the energy classification scheme 4 21. All publicly available sales and technical documentation is annually carefully reviewed and checked against Delbach's reported and tested values by the Eurovent staff. Should this webinar have sparked interest in you to find out more, then be sure to visit our website to download our comprehensive life science documentation. It will provide an even more in-depth look at what is important in air filters for food and pharmaceutical production processes. I do hope you have enjoyed today's webinar. My name is Thorsten Stoffel, Product Manager of Delbach Air Filtration. Make sure you subscribe to our LinkedIn channel or perhaps just drop us a memo. Have a good day and so long.